welcome back to Science with Greg. Today, we're going to be taking apart an old electric toothbrush, specifically an Oral-B electric toothbrush. Why are we still here? There's a fucking battery in this, I completely forgot. <laughs> I think the motor is right there. Oh! <laughs> it's gone up there! Have a look in there. Can you see cogs and stuff? Um, I mean, there's also all this stuff in here. Like, what is all this? This is the mechanism that must have... Oh! That's got cogs on it. What is in here? Um, we have uncovered a motor. It's encased in a plastic shell. Battery is underneath that, so... He is working just fine. Uh. It's off. Oh shit, the entire thing just came out. So this is the induction coil for charging. And it's charging. It sits like that. Charges the green cell, the battery in there. Wow! Wow! <laughs> Just to suffer. You can cleanly displace the motor. The reason it's not working is from water damage because the seal broke. I think I was just a bit too vigorous while brushing my teeth and uh, the top half yeah. of the toothbrush came off. Ready to disconnect the battery? I am ready to disconnect the battery. It's a very small battery. It's a NIM, it's not even lithium. Oh. Taking part the charge. charging port, Char I think we can call it. Docking station. Yeah, the docking station. Yeah. Completely resined in. Go at it with the saw. I don't think that's the best tool. I do. Do you know what that smells like? It smells like a hospital mask. I don't know if you've ever been put under, but it smells like the mask yeah, they the put on you. Cleansing alcohol, I think. Oh god, it really smells like hospital. There's so much shit in there. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite comedic. You've hit a metal core. Oh. Oh yeah. Well there's something in there. We should be running but current through it at the same time. Through here, it's only in the very middle. I can see a resistor in there. Oh wow. Look at the dust on the floor, I've just but noticed. What was this foily thing? There's a lot of dust on there. Good sawing is using the whole saw. You want to use all the teeth on here to get maximum efficiency. Oh yeah, look at that. Mm, that, is, that is some beautiful sawing. The pressure of the vise is causing a bit of friction. Yeah, no, that, is, that has caused some quite detrimental friction. Fuck me. Fuck. Oh yeah, all the teeth. That's what you want. Oh, metal. You can feel the burn. Oh, not again. Fuck. Shit. Fuck me. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. Oh. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was it. Well, look, that's kind of cool. We should have just sawn it straight in half in the first place, shouldn't we? Yeah. Although, after closer inspection, that is, that is a coil, that. It's not just... It looks like a thick bit of copper. Next on the agenda is to saw <laughs> the battery that was inside. No, 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 come back. Shall I, just, shall I just compress it in the vise? What's gonna happen, Seb? Um, it could catch fire. Yeah. It probably won't. You're better off just doing it quickly. Oh, Seb, I'm scared. What kind of battery is this? Is this like one that you should not do this with? It's nickel and something else. Is that bad? Should we axe it? Yeah, go on. Axe it. You need to do it harder than that. Whoa, that was actually pretty hard. Wow. Shall I try and split it directly down the middle? You won't be able to hit that, I guarantee. No, I will. Oh yeah. Ooh. Oh, I really got that one, look. Completely chopped in half. What now? Throw Ooh. it in the hedge? Yeah, go on. <laughs> well, okay, we're gonna test the, the motor from the uh, toothbrush. And it works. Wow. 